Okay, I am in central Utah. Um, I'd say about 40 miles southwest of Price, Utah. And I'm gonna go in and check out this Rochester panel. Um, it's supposed to be a really cool archeological site of uh, Native American rock art. So um, about a 20 minute hike, um, really a desolate area out here in the middle of nowhere. Well, there's, there's a little town over there. Not even a gas station, though. And um, it should be pretty cool. I think ser searching out and, and finding some of these unique sites for us. Uh, we like to swing by here if we have time. Take an alternate ride home um, on our last day. Uh, coming from, say, the Moab area. When we're doing our national par park tour. And uh, that way we can... Uh, see a couple of really cool stop areas really cool um big huge view areas but also see a couple of areas where we can visit some uh cool archaeological sites and the you know the rock art panels in southern utah dating back for thousands of years are really interesting to search out find and see um these guys occupied this this land and they lived off the land and they you know farmed this desolate desert landscape and it was just just amazing um thousands of years ago so uh let's go take a look at the rochester panel here in uh south central utah and um pretty pretty cool little spot so it's sure is quiet and these sites again no, there's not even a soul here and um, a really interesting stop for us let's go uh, take a look at the Rochester panel you know these panels are oftentimes in areas of great significance and to the native people water in the desert right here this this creek running you know it's just all so interesting in the fact that uh here's this creek running to this place that leads up to the panel over here in this lush little valley environment dry wash on the left side here coming in uh, the creek creek coming over from here with a decent amount of water in it you know, enough where they could farm and grow and have water and uh, just um, made it the reason why they spent time here and the reason that they worship this area so much. And it's like that every single place, you know, either a real spiritual, special place close to a river maybe, or just of significant, huge beauty when you look around. There's a little high point up here above it. It's down there in the desert varnish, but then you have this spectacular high point right above it where you have this incredible 360 view and creek running down what a special place now the rock art in southern utah is simply amazing the history thousands of years old messages left on the wall hard to decipher what they all mean but you can tell a little bit about the time period this is very old over 2000 years there's no horses in it there's no men on horses or people on horses. And uh, incredibly moving when you're here.